In this video, I want to show you a couple of clear bags, kind of like the one in, well, including exactly the one in the thumbnail photo and a couple others, and show you how you can organize your things inside those bags in a few different ways that looks really nice and not junky. Because I know a lot of people are concerned when they think about having a clear bag that people are just going to see all your stuff and it won't look good. So I have some ideas for you. <music> Hi YouTube, Autumn Beckman here. Welcome to my channel, or welcome back to my channel. My channel is all about luxury living on a budget, from high-end luxury handbags and small goods to the everyday luxuries of life. If that sounds interesting to you, make sure you subscribe, click the bell notification icon to be notified when I post new videos, and be sure to like the videos that you enjoy. And one of the perks of subscribing is that you get to see my community posts on the homepage of your YouTube channel, and that's where I post bargains, rare finds, discount codes, on these things that we love. I just filmed my metallics collection video, that's why I have so many metallics out in the background behind me and covering my desk. But I wanted to show you, I have this tote that was in the thumbnail that's clear with like a smoky PVC. And then I also have these two clear bags. And I've done videos on this one before and I have some other ideas in those videos, so I will link those below. But there is something that I wanted to try with this bag but I never had the piece to try it with until very recently. So I'm gonna try it with you guys and see how it works. All right, here's the bag empty without the stuffer inside. My go-to with these bags has always been to use pouches to hide your things and to make your things look nice. That's the big secret here. So I like to use my pochette accessoire. This bag is a little newer than the other gold one. Fits things a little bit tighter. The pochette accessoire just fits in there. Fits perfectly in there. But it doesn't take up the whole width of the bag. Something that I wanted to get to try was a mini pochette. And I just recently got the mini pochette in Azure. So I wanted to add that to the front. And that looks like this. And then there's still a little space on the side. So I could add a clay over there. And I can't lay it down because there's not the bag's not wide enough to lay it down So I have to stand it up on its side Like so turn the bag like this because you get a glare like that, but I mean that looks lovely, right? It's matchy matchy you get to show off Some pieces that you may have in your collection and they don't have to be luxury pieces You can put any pouches in here that are pretty you can put something with some kind of tropical design if you're going to the beach. Or you could put pieces that are different colors that all coordinate. So there's that. That works well. Another thing that I had wanted to try and that I bought thinking about this setup was this YSL card holder that kind of matches the Damier Azure. So I could slip it up front like this. Okay, so like I said, I've never tried this before, so what I'm seeing is that the logo is being covered up. You may care about that, you may not. I could try turning it sideways over by the clay and see how that works. So again, logo's covered up. Another idea, although this is where I usually keep my cell phone, is to move that card holder to the back pocket. And now it's easily accessible for you. You don't have to get into the bag to get to your debit card and you can see it, but nobody else can. It's up against your body. So there you go. That works pretty well. It works really well, actually. I like it a lot. Now with the tote, you can do a little more with it because there's more room to put more things, right? This doesn't have any pockets. This was something I wondered when I purchased it. I wondered if this front was a big pocket because it has that lip there. It's not, that's just decorative sewn on. So instead of just throwing a bunch of stuff in your tote bag like you may normally do in a bag that's not clear, I would recommend a large pouch that somehow goes with the bag, coordinates with it somehow, looks good with it in some way. And this pouch is not something that's available that, for you to purchase anymore. It's from a company called Person. It's a cosmetic pouch. I showed it in my last video, so I won't go as in depth on it this time but it's in their bronze leopard print. They have other pieces in this print still on their website, so I'll link them below, but this one isn't available. You may be able to find it elsewhere though, maybe eBay or something. So if you can get a big pouch that's tall and wide and fits in your bag, then you can hide all kinds of goodies in there and it still looks really nice. Now with something like this, this isn't as deep as the bag itself is. There's still more room here. So you could do two things with it. 
you can you can push it up to the front of the bag and then in the back behind it throw some things that you don't want people to see then and it'll be hidden by that pouch or you could push this to the back of the bag and then if you have some other pretty things that you maybe do want to show off then you could put those in front like maybe you have a bill pouch or some other kind of smaller pouch, a shut accessoire, a smaller cosmetic pouch. You may have a card holder that you want to throw up there. So I'm not going to fill this bag, but I'll just show you. So I have the leopard in the back, you can see, and then the YSL bill pouch and card holder up front. And because this is a smoky PVC, gives you a little bit of privacy, but also gives you a little peek. Uh, your pretty items. And that's another thing, if you have a lot of SLGs that you want, or not even a lot, but if you have some that you want to see for yourself or you wanna be a little showy, that's a way to do it is with one of these kind of clear bags. Personally, I think that combination is very pretty and functional. And of course, you know, I have other pouches. You could use all kinds of different pouches. I would just, again, big secret, instead of throwing stuff in there, use pouches, make it look prettier. And that's it for today. So thank you so much for watching. I hope that wasn't just too blatantly obvious, but was actually helpful to at least some of you. Hope to see you back here next time. I hope that you and your loved ones are doing well, and I hope you have a fantastic day. Bye.